Hello everyone, good day. How are you all doing? Um, this is going to be a very short video about the ADLF plan to plugin, which is now available via the link in the description of this video or attached to this video. Now, if you check out this um, overview here, this is the plans that come with the ADLM plan Swift plugin. Now, we have the monthly package, which is 7,000 error, and we have the six month package, which is the 38,000. That means you're saving 4,000 error off when you subscribe for six months. Then for the yearly package, which is on 5,000, that means you're saving like 9,000. In USD, that's um, $10 monthly, while for six months is around fifty dollars and yearly is a hundred dollars now we have the initial installation fee of fifteen thousand that means once you purchase or once you get this plugin or subscribe to the monthly package via the or any of the packages via the link in the description of this video you would have to pay an extra installation fee the first installation fee of fifteen thousand error this is what would be used to install the plugin on your device um, in USD, that's around twenty dollars for the initial installation fee. So that means at the initial stage, you're paying fifteen thousand error, and you're just subscribing via the link at seven thousand or six thousand or seventy-five thousand. That's the three plans that we have. So if you open up the link in the description of this video, you have this year. So this is the page it takes you to. You have the ADLM plans with plugin, you have the details of the plugin you can read through. Then we have the various plans. So you have the monthly plan, the six months plan, and the yearly plan. So those are the three plans that we have available. So once you do that, just click on subscribe. It takes you to where you check out. So you can just check out with and just input your card details there or your payment details there. Then we have a um, detailed description about the plugin. So you can just read through to learn more about this plugin and you can drop your reviews also after purchase so in usd i'm going to check just the usd here that's around this so this is the cost in us dollars okay so that's the subscription fee okay so once you've done that and installation is complete um this is plan swift so inside plan swift here you have this icon here so this is the icon you get you see this is added to your takeoff on that takeoff tools you get this icon that shows ADLM plugin and you have the templates also this template has been created to suit your purpose we have substructure we have various types of foundation we have the strip foundation raft foundation pile foundation um every type of foundation you need your lift base and all the whole year in this within the template aspect here then frames also we have all of these frames and all then swimming pool and all so we have various items of work so we cover from swimming pool um staircase block work finishes everything including electrical and plumbing works so the electrical and plumbing works have also been created to make your workflow easier i spent more video on this on this channel very soon so that's just an overview of the templates that comes with this plugin. Then within the ADLM tools here, so this is just an overview. This is a takeoff that has been done using this template tool here. Um, detailed videos on how to use each of them is on this channel in the playlist for ADLM plans with plugin. So you can just check that out on how the user guide on how to make use of this in general. So if you see your takeoff, you have various door openings various items on different sheets and all of that so let's move from there so when you click on this for the first time to tell you to log in okay so once you click on this on the front first time it brings this up now make sure your internet connection is on because if you don't have internet connection on it would not load it will tell you to give you an error that says internet connection required so i'll just log in this is the username and password that you used to register for the plugin. I mean, so after you've completed your purchase, your username and password will be sent to your mail, which you can use to log in to make use of this plugin app. Now, another thing is, if you are not logged in or if your subscription is not active, all of this, the templates disables. That means if you are not active or this, if this is not activated, all this becomes disabled. That means you can make use of it. Okay, so let's just quickly log in. 
So I'll just choose and I'll input the password. Then sign it. So Okay, now this is showing me that this details has already been logged in on another device. This is showing you that you can't share your user ID with someone else. So it's just unique for you. So because I logged in this account on someone else's device, it shows that user already logged in on that device. So that's what one thing you should take note of. Okay. So then just click on sign in button and this shows tells you welcome tells your username and your account is secure that means you've logged in successfully so once you've logged in successfully you can just widen this page out to view your takeoff so this takeoff i've done earlier so each of this folder here you can easily view the takeoffs that you've done easily so we have this also structured takeoffs so we have this here under substructure you have your takeoffs you've done column base you have your total network support surface treatment and all your concrete in column base you have your total takeoff details this then for all of each items of work you've measured for you can always view the details if you adjust if you adjust this here you can see all your units also so you can if you do a little bit of adjustment you can see your units here also so if I come back to roof also, I can easily generate my roof, my select roof covering. This under this is showing all of the sub items available. So if I select roof covering here, it tells me to impute the degree. So I just put probably five degrees roof. Okay. So this has done my roof members also automatically. So if I check out finishes here under finishes. Select my four tiles, you can see the different flows. If I select this here, that's what what tiles. Select floor tiles here. I have my vitrified flow tiles, skeleton, non vitrified external flow. So you have the total floor area and each the breakdown for each of them. And you have your total skeletons there. Then for openings also, I select my opening. This is just a quick run through of what you get with the Italian plans with plugin. Now with this here you have your total Intel concrete and information for those. You have your door schedule. For this also you have all of this. You can export to Excel also. So that saves to the file. Yeah, let me just export all the takeoffs also. So under finishes float tiles, all of this is here. I can export this to Excel. Finishes also exported. Then um substructure also. I'll pick up substructure it takes a while to load because there are so many items it's doing going through everything and adding everything up so substructure also overwrite so i'll come back to check all of this before the end of this video so just stay tuned in here where you see the result so once you've done all of this you have your material breakdown also in here material breakdown select substructure um loads it out See these are all the items under so substructure here. So I select probably excavation. There's no material for excavation. It works supports the kind of wood you are using. If you are using the white wood, which is um that's a 2.8. Um and normally this is a three meter wood by point three. Calculate so you have the wood here. Then surface treatment, you're living a compacting that's machine your concrete one to four mix and change the mix ratio form work. Also, you can calculate for your form work with blinding concrete. Your reinforcement also to total reinforcement probably this is okay. We have a reinforcement. Let's check for um ground floor. I think on the first floor. Let's check first we have reinforcement measured out. So if this is not measured out, you can just quickly do that. Let's just pick one of the columns and input the details. So all I can do here is just click trace my reinforcement by coming to take off summary. Then 
come down here so this is how you can trace your takeoff also so inside here you can trace your takeoff to this point then just put the length of bar probably um, 3.8 this is just an example the number of bar let's say um, four bars size of bar 12 just for an example just okay then we to pick this up this is just for your first um usage that you need to sign in if you are using it continuously you don't need to sign in again so let's just check what we did earlier the column see this is the reinforcement bar here if i come back to my material breakdown one flow select this so i just put the size of bar which is 12 mm calculate so it gives me my total um length of bar that's in meters so the length of bar that is required also so it gives you this calculation your blocks it gives you your blocks the number of blocks you need the cement and sand that you require plus drain also 150 mm block also so with this you can just so you have materials for every item of work that you have in here okay so because of this is in the, this is the area that's why so you have your links calculation also so all of your takeoffs and these exports to excel so to round up this video let's check what we exported to excel so you can just close once you are done with your takeoff and all just close everything and let's check out the excel so you see the takeoff that you did earlier on we we'll just do this wrap text so you can just do your own little bit of adjustment and you're good to go so you have the description the quantities and the units so you can just put in your rates and that's all so you see the takeoff that we exported earlier just put your rates in front multiply it and that's exported with your detailed descriptions also okay now um let's see so with this you see how to export to excel from the plugin you see how to prepare material breakdown this is for the opening day So it has given you your burglar bars, your burglary bars, the total area for that, the door schedule, your reinforcements, um, your concrete details, formwork to beam, that's lintel formwork, this is here, your lintel formwork, this is here, so you can just, for door also, so your door opening area, concrete, so that's your lintel concrete, formwork, this, and you have your door schedule also here for you so just a little bit of manual adjustment and you are good to go so that's for that then for ground flow also when you export it you see your quantities here also layered out concrete and column description of your block work vibrated in situ block the quantity so all of this can just do a little bit of manual adjustment and you are good to go so that is a quick overview of what happens after you've installed and you're making use of the plugin now. See you in the next video.